Hey guys, welcome to another episode on my channel. So today I'm going to show you how to create a custom library for your ESP32 or Arduino projects and how to include it locally in your platform IO Visual Studio. So I'm just going to repeat, we are not going to use GitHub in this case. We are going to create custom library locally and we are going to include it locally. For that purpose, I have already uh, created this directory lips and in here I'm going to uh, create a new directory, my custom lib okay and I'm going to include uh, this directory into my workspace. All right, in here we are going to create two files. Let's call it mylib.h and mylib.cpp. So from this point on, we are just going to uh, create one uh, CPP class with header file. So with uh, mylib.h, we are going to say if and def my underscore lib underscore h then define my underscore lib underscore and in here we are going to uh, create class call it my underscore lib we are going to have public elements let's say my lib uh, for constructor we are going to provide value of integer type okay then we are going to uh, have one integer function uh, get int all right and private we are going to have only one element that is integer my int all right of course and one more line and if okay header file it's done so you are probably already see uh, where i'm going with this at the end i want to be able to uh, create simple object of uh, my lib to set it some value during construction and i want to be able to get that value uh, later on and now we are going to do uh, my lib uh, cpp so in here i just want to include my lib.h and first we are going to do my uh, lib my lib constructor integer value all right and i want to set my lib my int to value all right and we are going to have mar one more function that is uh, integer uh, type function for my uh, lib get integer and this function is going to return my lib my integer all right so uh, this is done and now I'm just going to uh, remove uh, this uh, directory uh, from uh, my uh, workspace. So I'm going to open it in here. Okay, you see that uh, we have our two files. And now in order to uh, include uh, this library in my main project uh, that is called simple test, I'm just going to uh, close uh, these two files from editor. So in order to be able to uh, include this in my code, what I have to do? I'm going to copy this entire uh, directory in my lib folder. Okay, you see I have it in my lib now. And now I'm able just to include it. Include my lib.h and we are able to use it. So now I'm just going to say my lib, this is type i'm going to call it just like lib with uh, two b's and i'm going to set value let's say 1000 okay this is totally fine and in here i'm going to print it print ln i'm going to print uh no name it's lib and function it's get int all right i'm going to 
build this code now. All right. And I'm going to upload this code to my ESP32 microcontroller. All right, I'm going to open my serial monitor and we are printing thousand. Okay, guys, I hope that you learned something new, something interesting. So please like, subscribe and see ya.